Are your files not showing up in Finder Search? Let me show you how to fix it. All right, so if you're not finding your files inside of Finder or Spotlight Search, even though you know the exact name of the file and it's still not showing up, it probably comes down to the fact that your computer is not properly indexing. Now, what is indexing? Let's make this super, super simple. Just suppose for a second, you're inside of a library. It's a giant library with tons of floors, thousands and thousands of books. Now, you have one specific book in mind. You know the title of that book. You just need to know where to find that book. Your computer's exactly the same thing. It actually has a giant library of all of your files, and an index is like a map of all of those files and where they're stored on your computer. So sometimes that map can actually get out of date. So you'll add a file, you'll rename a file, and for whatever reason, Finder and Spotlight Search don't properly update the index. So that map is missing the file. Therefore, when you type it in, it doesn't show up. How do we make sure that our map is actually up to date and all our files are showing up? Well, fortunately, it's pretty simple. So open up your Mac and hit Command Space. Bar. From there, you can type in system settings. You can also get to this by going up to this little Apple icon in the top left of your screen and clicking on system settings. Okay. Once you click that, system settings shows up and we're going to search for spotlight search. Okay. So we're going to click this little guy, spotlight search right there, and you're going to see that there's a bunch of preferences. Now, depending on what version of Mac you're using, this might be in a slightly different spot, but what you're looking for is down here where there's a little button that says spotlight privacy. You're going to click that you're gonna see that we have this privacy window prevent Spotlight from searching these locations. Okay, so we can actually reset our index using this privacy tab by hitting this little plus icon. We're going to tell Finder and Spotlight Search, okay, we don't want you to actually index anything inside of our hard drive. So look for this little area in your locations here that says the name of your computer. You're going to click on the hard drive and then click choose. And now you can see it's going to say, are you sure you want to prevent Spotlight from searching your Mac hard drive? Yeah, I do actually. And so now you can see that under privacy, I've added Macintosh HD. So what's going to happen when I hit done here is Finder and Spotlight are going to re-index the computer after excluding all of those files. So what it's going to do essentially is delete that entire index. And now what we're going to do is open Spotlight privacy again, and we're going to remove our Macintosh hard drive from this exemption, just like that, hit done, and voila. Finder and Spotlight Search are going to go ahead and make a brand new index because now we've added this entire hard drive they have to look through and add all the files for. So hopefully this fixes Finder Search and Spotlight Search for you forever. And the next time that Finder starts acting up again, all you have to do is go back in, repeat this process, and you should be golden. Now, as I said, depending on your OS, this might be a little bit different in terms of location. So if you find it is different, leave that in the comments below. Where did you find it? So other people watching this video can be helped by that. And if it didn't work, let me know as well because Apple is constantly updating these things. And so it's good to know for other people here Let's just pitch in as a community and keep the information going. All right. If this video brought you some value, smash that thumbs up button. Make sure to leave a comment below. Hit subscribe if you want more tutorials like this one. And I'll see you in the next video. In the meantime, create something awesome. Peace.